are going to send things on over to News 8's Josh Scheinblum, who is live in New Haven. And Josh, some people were hoping the arrival of spring would help the bottom line of their business, but uh, Mother Nature had other plans. She definitely did, Brian. And when you go around our state, and you see plants that kind of look like this. You'd think that if you owned a home and garden store, that today would have been a good day for business. But as we learned, that wasn't the case. All is quiet at Bell Nurseries in North Haven, not just because the flowers don't have much to say. I like to be selling the plants right now. This is this is our living. This is what we do best. Jim Aiello is one of the owners of this establishment, and right now he's all alone. We're about two weeks behind. They've only had around a dozen customers since he opened the doors in the morning. Usually on, a, on a, a March, Saturday, we usually have between 75, maybe 100 customers during the day. It may be the first full day of spring, but Jim blames it all on Mother Nature. It was snowing just a few hours ago. Once this weather breaks, we're going to be swamped. The lack of sales aren't the only thing he's got to make his case. Make sure if there's water. The greenhouse is mostly empty, and if you can believe it, They've sold more ice melt and firewood on this day than flowers. This time of year, ice melter and firewood is usually on the back burner. Down in New Haven, over at the restaurant Brick, you'll hear workers airing similar grievances. I've lived in New Haven my whole life, and I've never had this much snow in such a short period. Their prized outdoor rooftop patio is covered in ice and snow, which makes this spot a tough sell, even with the start of a warmer season. The rooftop is a huge uh, draw in because we are one of the only rooftops in New Haven. So a lot of people come in asking about whether or not it was open. In case you can't tell, it's not. It's looking a little uh, delayed. But back at Bell Nurseries, Jim is still working hard. Confident the snow will melt soon and green will be replacing white once again. I think we're going to do okay. ILO says that they do plan to make up those sales in the coming weeks. The only thing, though, is that does mean some busy days ahead. For now, we are live in New Haven. Josh Scheinblum, News 8.